hi there so in this video i'm going to show you how to use rating bar widget in your android app so first thing create one demo or sample app and it should look empty such as this then open your activity underscore main.xml file and go into text mode and here we are going to add our rating bar okay so let's start by adding our rating bar we have to set its layout width and height to wrap content so we use android layout underscore align on top so let me check align parent top okay set it to true then next is aligning our center horizontal so android layout center horizontal so let me check where it is center horizontal set it to true then next thing we are going to also use margin top so let's add that margin top and set it to true or you can specify where you and here you mention let's say 44 dp and finally we are going to add id so android id and point your at the rate plus id equals to rating one okay so that's your rating bar created you can check that but currently it won't appear immediately so we'll wait okay so now as you can see our rating bar appeared now the, below that I want to add one button so let's do that so let's add our button set to wrap content both layout width and height and the next thing I want to do is I want to put its layout below let's say below my rating bar okay also you can set its align left property layout underscore align left to id rating okay and then finally i want some text for my button and i'm gonna say submit rating and then set its id to button one so add the rate plus id then slash button one okay so we have our initial design ready it will show the button now okay as you can see our submit rating button and rating bar now inside main activity java what we're going to do is we are going to simply add our code so here i'm going to use rating bar so we're going to use rating bar one okay make sure that spelling is correct and also don't forget to add the class using alt enter and then button button okay now inside your protected void on create we are going to create instance of a new method where we are going to point to our button action so let's name this method add listener on button we are just going to point it out and outside this protected void method we are going to create that method public void add listener on button and here 
I'm going to create my rating bar one instance so we use rating bar and then call for find view by ID then point to our rating one then our button we are going to initiate that too and then simply create on click listener action for this so let's call for button dot set on click listener then new view dot on click listener okay now here inside we will use public void on click and then view arc zero okay and here we mention string rating equals to string dot value of and here we are going to check for character so the character will have boolean value so boolean value needs to be catched so we use rating bar one dot get rating okay and once you get the rating we are going to convert that into string okay and then we will create toast instant so we call for get application context and then ask our toast to use rating and then show it for let's say toast.length long or short you can choose i'm going to use long and outside that i'm going to use show method okay make sure that you put all in caps and that's pretty much it okay now as you can see if i click on that after choosing the rating it should show me a toast message so what i'm going to do is i'm going to open emulator instance and run this app so as you can see this is my connected device clicking on ok should start the app okay now i'm going to select a rating let's say three and then i'm going to click on this submit a rating button so it should open one toast message and it says 3.0 so what if i choose three and a half then it should show me that 3.5 okay so let me cut a few more and it shows the message with correct rating so you get the idea that this is how you use rating bar in your app